Hi, this is Dan. Welcome to the beginning um, of the Weebly tutorials I'll be running. Uh, this one is the opening tutorial, so I'm going to run you through a few of the basics, um, including what Weebly is all about, um, just navigation, basic navigation around the site, what they offer you, um, and then slowly as we progress um, through the tutorials, we'll run through the functionality of the site, how to create the site, some of the back end information um, that you'll need to know. Um, through to more advanced features like tweaking the HTML in the back end, um, looking at the CSS, um, uploading your site, um, domain names, hosting, that kind of thing. So uh, this is just the opening tutorial, so we'll get started. So if you open your uh, browser and if you go to weebly.com, this takes you to the site. So. There's a lot of information here, but basically you're concerned with two main areas initially. Firstly is the create free website section here. The beauty of Weebly is everything is simple. So here, all you're presented with to get started is three fields. So your username, your password, and your email. That's all you'll need. A lot of other sites require a lot of other information that's, well, quite frankly, unnecessary. So it's really simple to get going. And once you have created your account and you come back to Weebly, if you look up in the top right here, this is where you can actually go and um, log into your account. Uh, it's nice and simple. So there's two main areas that you're concerned with here. So I'll just take you briefly through the um, area at the top, the menu. So Weebly offer a lot of information um, in a number of areas. So firstly, home obviously will take you back to this page from another page. The second one along is features. I'll click on there. This gives you a nice breakdown of what Weebly is about. So if you're deciding whether to sign up with them or not, or start creating a site, just have a read through the information here. It's um, a wealth of knowledge. It gives you um, a brief overview of what kind of features they offer um, in terms of um, you know widgets and whether it'll do video or um, any blogging power it has, how to get it hosted, that kind of thing. So just some um, good snapshots of information here that's available for you. The next one along in the menu is blog. Um, Weebly are known for um, having high blog activity, so I do recommend you keep an eye on this section. Um, they're constantly posting um, not just what features they've released, but um, what's in the pipeline. So um, they do listen to their users and listen to requests, and there is a voting system if you want a new request, a uh, new feature, so they will listen to you. So this is a really good section to keep your eye on, as you can see on the right-hand side here. They also feature a service status. Now this gives you an idea of um, whether there are any issues with Weebly. Um, there are from time to time, and sometimes it will go. Um, the, the service will go down for a, a number of reasons, um, one of which is um, they are doing an update to the service, so it just needs to go down for a short time. Um, so you can keep your eye on this, and this will give you an idea of the status. As you can see here from the archives, they are quite prolific. They date back to May 2006, so a lot of information here, um, and they'll um, they'll throw on some kind of feature videos and give you an idea visually of what they're working on or any of the new features available. And you're free to comment them on on, on them as per most other blogs. Uh, the next one along is support. Obviously, this is a uh, a big area. Um, they've improved this recently, actually. Um, so I mean, they're fantastic with support. I've had a few issues over the years and they've been back to me very promptly with an answer which is fantastic but they have tweaked this support center so before you jump on an email or if you click on the kind of need more help section here and ask them a question um, I really do urge you to just have a quick flick through this section and see if the answer is contained within because the likelihood it is um, and you probably find that if you find the answer yourself you're going to learn a little bit more so it'll help you in the long run so you know everything from a beginner's guide um, Things like you know first steps and um, switching your themes, how to get a blog going um, and publishing your site for the first time, right through to some more advanced features like e-commerce, selling items and um, earning revenue through your website through adverts, that kind of thing, um, and statistics and search engine optimization. So um, there's a wealth of information here, so I do urge you to jump in there if you have any issues. Um, and then there's just a brief um, outline of the company here, which is great to see a couple of cool snazzy shots of their uh, of their office and so forth and you can click through onto a few reviews and articles that have been written about Weebly over the years so um, you know they're, they're looked upon favorably in the industry um, there's a number of, um, of other websites and other providers that provide a very similar um, service to Weebly um, I've used virtually all of them um, and I have to be honest every time I just come back to Weebly whether it's 
um, creating a flash site, an HTML site, a blog, um, a photo kind of um, portfolio site, that kind of thing, you know, for bands or uh, artists, uh, you will pretty much find um, Weebly contains everything you'll need. It's far simpler than the others, it's less commercial than the others. Um, and it's just easier to get going and maintain it. There's a lot more flexibility as well. So that's basically what Weebly offer um, and some basic navigation around um, the, uh, the features. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave them on the YouTube channel. And I look forward to seeing you in the next tutorial number two.